to the Mercer Boys uh, podcast reaction with uh, Tom McDonald, um, This House, White Boy, response. Okay, so this is mad. This is mad white. I think there's a white boy and then there's a white boys. We reacted to white boys and somebody else in the mafioso was like, yo, react to white boy. And I was like, okay, there's a difference between white boys. I thought we reacted to white boys. They were like, nah, there's a white boy though, a singular white boy. I was like, wow, there's only one of them. I thought there was two. So like, you know what I'm saying? So now it's getting real easy. Um, and, uh, uh, yeah, we're getting into it though. But like, what you what, what you think is going to hit like? Man, I don't know. White boy. We listen to white boys. I was talking about some white boys. Now we about to listen to white boy. <laughs> and now we just gotta see what's cooking. You know what what this video is about. And um, yeah, I can't wait to see it. Pet boys does everything mm -hmm. for less. You dig? In fact. <laughs> Lately everyone been talking crazy Feel like everybody's got some shit to say They misinterpreted my good intentions And expected I was just gonna step away If there's a heart that pumps and there's a breath to take Then I won't bite my tongue as Now you know somebody gangster when they talking to your soul But they're not even talking to you He's not even looking at the people he's talking at And he's being vicious with his approach Imagine somebody's to like somebody angry. They yelling at you, but they yelling at you like you like you you right here, and they yelling at you this way. You think what do you, what do you think will happen? Um, gonna get samurai kick, boy, like jujitsu. I mean, I, I mean, I wouldn't know. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is his white boy response. Arr as long as I'm awake and they don't have the guts to make a dumb mistake I'd rather crash a car than never touch the brakes I built this f***ing house They're the kind of people that be dying for exposure They're the kind of people that get mad and lose composure They're the kind of people that are never going forward They're just the ones, the ones that are looking for apologies Hating real loud but they follow me Screaming at the top of their lungs I'm the scum of the earth in the same damn breath Trying to preach about equality Back before I wrote the song on race They all ignored that I had something great They tried to edge me out, they didn't hear my bars They tried to tell me that I wasn't built for fame Fast forward to when I'm paid I ain't spent a dollar on the f***ing chain I'll get my mama house, I'll get he just stunner on you. He said he got racks that he can bring out from the bank and bring out in a video. You want to talk to you like that? Congratulations. <laughs> Don't get robbed. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. You heard you heard the um the black the Black Panther guy? He like um they, they thought he was about to rob the bank when he was just taking out some money. Come on now. They always think we about to rob the bank. But we got the bank in the bank. Come I on. wonder if Tom had any issues taking the money out the bank. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, I, wait, I didn't even hear about that, though. That's crazy. Yeah, that's right. Nice. It was wow. in Atlanta. Wow. But Tom may have had some issues, though, because he's mm -hmm. a large uh, Caucasian man <laughs> with tattoos and, like, braids and stuff. So, hey, maybe, maybe you know what I'm saying? He, he does embrace the culture, I guess. My dad a call, make my sister rich, she'll never work again And this hater is so underwhelming I'm conditioned for all the abuse Seeing the reaction videos all blowing up And you're welcome for all of the views Blow up my Twitter He was just talking directly to us what? For all the abuse. Seeing the reaction videos all blowing up, and you're welcome for all of the views. Blow up my. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I appreciate you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Shout out Keep to Tom music. McDonald. Yeah, yeah. You know, to, for making these videos, because if it wasn't for the video, <laughs> he wouldn't be reacting. I mean, that's facts. I can't disagree with you. Hey, that. man. Keep dropping music. I'm going to keep reacting. You know what I'm saying? Just, exactly. don't, just don't get signed, because I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to make money too. You know what I'm saying? So, like, yeah, I'm just trying to make sure them, them green stay beanie. You feel what I'm saying? If you, if you, pick, if you pick up my drift, you dig me. But, um, yeah. Twitter, y'all just keep making me bigger. Y'all just keep showing your trigger. Y'all just keep missing the. Hey, that's a fact though. He acknowledges it. He says y'all just making me bigger. Hey man, I'm trying to get. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get like you when I grow up. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be like you when I grow up. Um, you are aspire to be. <laughs> this nigga Kevin. 
<laughs> and so you inspired to be a white boy. <laughs> No, nah, but honestly, this is really white boy good. singular, bro. This is actually really good marketing. Like he must have made more money off of just responding to a song he made. <laughs> imagine you respond, bro. Imagine, bro. I, bro, low. Like don't even nah. Cause I was like literally one of my ideas, right? Mm-hmm. I ain't even gonna talk about it too much. But like, yo, mm-hmm. imagine like he like was reacting to his own videos, or reacting to other people reacting to his own mm-hmm. videos. <laughs> nah, that would be hilarious. That'd be more views, bro. You probably get more views than the original video. But why did I keep doing art? Me, I lay nothing to even consider. Man, I built this f-ing house. I'm the kind of person making music with a purpose. You're the kind of people that be hating on the surface. I'm the kind of you ain't used to, the kind of make you nervous. Yeah, back before I even wrote the record, I can see this coming like a fortune teller. Run a calm seat, don't make a skilled sailor. So I thank the heavens for the stormy weather. Okay, fast forward to when we're old and gray. I'll be looking back when they posted hate and it will hurt a bit, but it was worth it when your dream is getting hurt no matter what they say. I try conveying that I love us all. And the way I did it left them so appalled. I used a broken arm to try and break their walls. No matter what they say, they know it took balls. I surveyed the land and I found a location, unloaded the lumber and pounded the stakes, and I blended the bones of the people who hated with blood and cement. Then I poured the foundation, I built the frame with all my guilt and shame, and then I chiseled my name in the date in the base. See, this is like, all right, so like, I like fast rap sometimes, mm-hmm. but I also don't like to get caught up in the I'm just bobbing my head because that was that's what was just happening. I ain't gonna lie, like, like, he was just rapping mad, like. Yeah, honestly, I kind of just started getting caught up in like the nah. Wait, what is he saying? I'm just, <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, oh snap, nah, he flowing right now, like you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, that's a fact. That's a big fact. <laughs> um, I definitely feel like, um, yeah, I definitely feel like the, the, for me, fast rap is not really for me because I I like more like I like words spaced out to like in in a meaning thing in a meaningful way like poetry, you know, because I feel like it hits better. But fast rap hits too, like you catch the bars fast. And that hits too. It's just certain people, you know, likes what they like, and that's what I like. But shout out to Tom McDonald with this house white boy response. Um, yeah, you order a braider to your house, you open the door and it's him, and he got some tools. They to said braid a braider to yeah, you order a braid to braid my hair. Yeah, and you open the door and it's him. What do you What are you gonna do? What can you do? He's already here. <laughs> He's like, all right, man. Like, what are you using that for? <laughs> Sorry, my man. It's like, just touch <laughs> only above the neck. <laughs> no. Basement, I carve my initials and all of the boards and the beams that are needed for structural greatness. No record label, no distribution, no cosign, no publicist, no man. Hey, appreciate you. <laughs> hey, man. If you have a... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You want to sign on my label? Uh... <laughs> if you ever want some beats, I could beatbox for you. <laughs> no. I require uh, every employee to give me five thousand dollars. <laughs> nah, it's over. It's over for that man. <laughs> Yo, yeah, you can sign a market label. I, I require every employee to to deposit five thousand uh, dollars as a uh, uh, signing signing fee. Five thousand dollars signing fee. You'll get that back uh, as a two month uh, security deposit. Um, <laughs> Goddamn con artist. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Manager, no teammates, no money to make up my budget with, no groceries, no studio, no booking agent, Wait. no bucket list, no pe- no studio. <laughs> Nah, just vibes. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing but just nah, vibes. Nah, no groceries is OD as fuck, bro. Just vibes. <laughs> bro, son said no groceries? <laughs> nah, hold on, bro. I need to make up my budget with no groceries, no... <laughs> just vibes. <laughs> bro, no groceries is nuts. So when Gina Aiko said eat the booty like groceries, you know what she was talking about. <laughs> I respect women. Nah, I am crying right now. No studio, no booking agent, no bucket list, no PR, no marketing, just fans. Man, we built this f-ing house when my days end and it's vacant and they bury me with that only key. My biggest fans gonna break in with a Ouija board and a box of chalk draw pentagram hail. Ouija board? Nah, what type of time are y'all on over there? Ooga booga. 
<laughs> Scooby Doo, where mm-hmm. are you? <laughs> we got some work to do. Yeah, you climbing Velma? Velma or uh, what was the other one? Daphne. Daphne? Velma or Daphne? Daphne. Velma. Velma? You Wait. act like you like nerds, bro. Like, you're. You cap it. <laughs> oh, Daphne was the nerd? Daphne was the nerd. Oh, no, Daphne in the. No, no, Velma was a nerd. Velma was a nerd. Yeah, Velma, Velma, Velma. Velma was a nerd. Yeah, I was. You act like you like nerds, bro. Nah, Daphne was a yeah, well, Daphne was an IG baddie. <laughs> she, she's an IG baddie. Um, I mean, Daphne get it too. I think. <laughs> both get it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> bro, this man is not. Bro, he is capping, bro. He was not nah, taking Velma. Nah, Velma was Velma. Velma was wearing nun dresses every day, different colors. With like stumpy glasses, bro. Like you were, I don't know. Oh, not definitely. Unless she was watching like the cartoon porn, like where she looked different or something like that. But like, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Say in, try to bring me back from that wooden box Y'all tried to fill my grave with Then I'll sit on the roof with the rifles I hid in the fridge And they'll shoot at the men on the ridge Who are coming to undo the work that I did Then they'll block off the highway that leads to the crib And put sensors on all of the boards on the bridge So they know when they're coming to empty the clip Then they'll cut all the bodies and cut off That was elite finger guns, so I ain't gonna lie The crib and put sensors on all of the boards on the bridge So they know when they're coming That's pretty solid finger gun action Probably shot a gun before. Nah, yeah, definitely. That's 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 pretty elite. That's pretty elite. Like he has a tight he has a tight grip on those. Like, Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I was even like. Yeah, I wasn't that was, I was even talking about that, but like, uh, I, I get it. I'm in the the clip, then they'll cut all the bodies and cut off the skin, then connect all the pieces with needles and pins and attach it to 10 feet of branches and twigs and then plant it in mud till it stands in the wind. And I'll stand there and look at this thing that we did that we never imagined we do because of them. Our blood and sweat and tears went into what we built till we were bags. So we used blood and sweat and tears of enemies to build our flag. We built this house, we laid these bricks, we set these traps, these flames, we lit our haters doused in gasoline. They brought. Man, like honestly, I'm glad this whole like last minute was just a whole scheme of him just like talking about uh, how they built their fan base. I mean, that's a great thing to build your own fan base is a hard thing, but a great thing to do. You know what I'm saying that's why he probably got all his fans hating you know? on. <laughs> Facts, you know what I'm saying? Nah, nah, all them, nah. We some of them is mafiosos. You know what I'm saying mafioso. Some of them see the 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 humor for what it is rather than the seriousness um, because. Honestly, I was, you know, people would be too serious. Hey, man. On the internet, man. MLM. Say MLM. MLM. Hey, MLM. 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 <laughs> MLM. Mike Tyson had that. <laughs> MLM. Nah. MLM is a goddamn scam. MLM. What you mean? Oh, MLM? Yeah, this nigga talking about um, multi-level marketing. Nah, I was talking about, um, <laughs> I was talking about my feelings and lives matter. Mafia's is life, man. I'm crying. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Mafia's is. Just like. Who the? To try and torture Swift. <laughs> Let them hate, dog. Everyone will have something to say, dog. Your opinions don't mean trying to judge your engine by your paint job. Gravestone, I'm a cheap death. There's too much I ain't seen yet. They think that I got it way over my head, but I feel like I just got my feet wet. We're trying to dream more when sleep less. Avoid the pills when we're depressed. Remember to not be too hard on ourselves. If we cut deep enough, we are bleed red, man. You never know when it's time to go. Heaven's all. Are you influencing people to cut themselves? I didn't say that. That was a question. <laughs> when the bars are closed, so seize the moment. Don't leave it hope and you'll breathe tomorrow. You could be a ghost. I'm living my life. The finish line is right in front of me. Made a fishing wire, so I'll never see it till it's too late. When God shakes my hand, please celebrate. Please celebrate. Please celebrate. Please celebrate. Please celebrate. Please celebrate. That was a hard line. That was a hard line. That was Tommy Donnells with uh, 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 the 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 Zam um what was those uh, white boy? That was no 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 I'm lying. That was uh this house Tommy Donnells with, with this house. Uh, what what you think about those? Um, I think it was cool. Um, the fast bars though like kind of caught me off guard because you know I'm I'm not really used to listening. To, I used to listen to fast bars like you know like all lyrical rap. I used to listen to that a lot back. Couple like years years ago, like probably like ten years ago, um, but I mean it was cool. It was cool. It was cool. I mean it was a response to. Him. <laughs> I mean that's like the quickest way to make a bag. And they, what 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 song idea can I make today? You know what? I'm just gonna respond to my other song. So I mean I can't be mad. You know he literally responded to himself, which is <laughs> which is great because you don't really gotta explain yourself to anybody. 
So if you could explain this stuff to people and get paid and get eight million views, nine. Nine million views. Congratulations. Kudos to you. My <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Don't wrestle me. You know saying yeah. you should go join the AEW. You imagine you join the AEW, right? Which is apparently like some new wrestling stuff, right? Um, imagine you join the the, A, the AEW, right? And you were rapping wrestler. You're gonna be better than John Cena. I'm telling you. John Cena barely took it seriously. Feel me? But he was the hood, he was the hood favorite. He was like the 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 um, WWE even the lights. Feel me? You could be the you could be the the, the, the Tom McDonald. Feel me? You could be the you could be the Batista, the Caucasian version, but rapper <laughs> instead of actor. He said the Caucasian version. <laughs> I'm crying. Nah, but um, would you would you get those get those out of five fire? What do you think? I would say like a three. Three. Yeah. Um, I like how he finished it. I like how he finished it. He finished it strong. You feel me? He finished it strong and he uh, kept it kept the, 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 the theme going and uh, he was basically he was like, Yo, we built this we built this guys, we built it so strong, we didn't need no PR, no groceries. I, I don't know how you got scrape vibes. Like I don't know how you got this far with no groceries. Like this man's stomach is empty, boy. I don't know how you got that big. It must be steroids. Cause you're not eating groceries and you that big boy, like you was a wrestler with no groceries. Vibes. What tip is you on? Like this man's <laughs> starving, boy. Like how? You know what I'm saying? Like what? Like how? You know what I'm saying? But um the yeah, facts though. He was he was snapping with those like the flow. I'm gonna get that three and a half out of five fire emojis for me. He was, he was doing his thing. Um, I wouldn't listen to that again though. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like I wouldn't download low dose because it was just like it a it was him basically responding to a different song he put out already. Uh, which we didn't even hear that one yet. But um, uh, so we had a uh, listen to that one. But that one and, and uh, so it was that and also like it was just like he was talking to like his core fans. You feel me? That like really like him. For me, not that I don't like him, but like you know his core fans and like yo we like we built from the ground up. You feel me? Um, no no groceries. No PR, no management, no help, no cosign, and no groceries. I gotta keep saying no groceries. You know what I'm saying? That's important for me. Um, but yeah, so um, for sure, definitely. In fact, for sure. But um, make sure you subscribe to the Mercy Boys podcast. What is he? You know what I'm saying? Turn on the post notification bell so you know every time we drop a new video. You know, join the mafioso. You dig me? It's, 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 it's nice over here, you know. Facts. Make sure you go ahead and check out the Merce Boys podcast on all audio streaming platforms and also on Instagram as well. And while you're there, make sure you also check out Taylor L. Jazz on Instagram. Favorite J, Instagram, everywhere. Come on now. <laughs> you dig, dig, but you know, I'll truly leave my with a quote, though. Um, sometimes you just got to respond to yourself. That's it. Just respond to yourself. Hmm. Probably learn something. Mm. Learn a new skill, you know what I'm saying? Yesterday I learned how to pick my toenails with one of my other toenails. It was it was actually like pretty impressive. Like I was like, damn, how did you even do that, Taylor? Man, I learned I, I, it's a talented individual. Yeah.